Welcome back to the King's Queen, where I teach you how to master your hustle with graphic design. And if you would like to learn how to make this trending text design, stay tuned. Alright, before we get started, I'd like to give a shout out to the Double Dutch Design School. They are another channel on YouTube. Great group of girls, well not a group, two girls, two ladies. They do t-shirt designs, pretty much the same thing that I'm doing. Um, they gave me the idea to do this a while back on one of their videos, except for they use two different browsers, two different applications to do it. But the way I'm going to show you, you only need Canva. Now you will need the Canva Pro if you're going to make um, PNG files. But um, other than that, you only need Canva. So let's get started. Um, okay, I'm gonna hit the letter T. So my text box will pop up and I'm going to change my text font to Anton since it's the text is thicker and wider. I'm going to type grad and I'm going to duplicate it by clicking control and D and I'm going to change this to squad. Grad squad is a popular um, saying for t-shirts at the moment so that's why I picked it. Okay, so I'm going to make it a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger, but now I'm going to turn it at an angle. It doesn't matter what angle, how deep you want your diagonal to be. I'm going to do it like that, and now I'm going to download and transparent background. PNG. Let's download that. Give me a few seconds. Okay, the next step. You don't move the text that you have. All you simply do is click on grad, then click effects, and we're going to make it hollow. And I'm going to take the thickness down to 30, around 30. 30 yeah 30 and we're going to do the same to squad make it hollow put the thickness down to about 30 and do the same thing that we just did with the solid go to download transparent background and we're going to download that Okay, after that, we're done with this here. I don't need this, so I can delete it. And you upload those two files that you just downloaded. I already have them on here, so. I don't need to download them again. Here we go, we have the hollow one, we have the solid one. Now you're going to drag over and grab them both click position make sure they're in the center and the middle make sure they are lined up evenly now we're going to pull down one of these rulers I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so I can make sure I get it lined up correctly we are going to We're going to rotate 
both of them at the same time. So we make sure that they are completely even. Use the arrow to make sure, and that looks about right. Okay, I'm gonna click off of them. I'm gonna click on whatever file is on top. It really doesn't matter how you have them layered. And you click the this little notch here and you're just gonna drag look at that easy peasy and there we go we have a cute design and if you want to take it a step further watch this I got this from the double dutch design school you take your line you change the color they use pink I'm gonna use gold and they simply turn the line so that it is lined up with the diagonal of the the intersection of the letters I'm gonna stretch this and there we go rotate it a little bit Oops, did not mean to do that. Just hit undo. And there we go. There's our design. I'm going to group it together so I can make it a little bit bigger so I can see. And there we go. You can do this with any text phrase graduation, Father's Day. Mother's Day in the school. Mother Day Mother's Day is gone, but it will be back again next year, so but any subject, any simple text that you come up with, you can use this trick. But um I hope you enjoyed the video. If you got some value from what I have shown you, click that like button, click the subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you. Get that, get that.